In this tutorial, I'll teach you some basics of animation in rooms. So you can see in this room, I have this robot character that's floating up and down and whose top is rotating. If I go to edit and I tap that object and I click model, I can see that there are three animation frames. And if I go back to the main view and I look at the properties of this, I can see that those frames are looping. If I wanted to, I could have them ping pong, go back and forth. I could have them shuffle randomly. I could have it animate once and stop. In this case, uh, loop works well, and I can adjust the speed, uh, but fast feels good for that. Okay, so how would we do this if we wanted to add animation to an object that doesn't have any? So I'm gonna get rid of this guy, and I'm gonna pull an example from the library that I know does not have any animations. There's Nick, my teammate, and as you'll see, he doesn't move. So let's say we wanted to make him blink. What I'm gonna do is go to the model editor, select add frame, and then I'm gonna to start to zoom in, and if he's blinking, well, what does that look like? Let's choose the color picker, skin color, and paint, and let's just start to close his eyes. So every new frame I add, I'm gonna close his eyes a little bit more until they are completely shut. And now you can see on the bottom, I've got my first frame, second frame, third, fourth, and fifth. Now when I hit check mark, it's gonna loop that animation, which doesn't look very natural. For blinking, you'd want ping pong. Uh, still doesn't look quite natural because he's doing it constantly, whereas people pause between blinks. So I'm gonna adjust the pause parameter and adjust the speed so he blinks a little bit more quickly until this feels about right. That seems pretty good. Let's go to preview. And now he blinks. So that's basic animation.